Hi there Arts Foundation patrons, I'm Simon Bowden, of course Executive Director of the Arts Foundation. Welcome to the first video for Arts Foundation patrons of 2016. I do hope you had a wonderful holiday and Christmas break. We're down on the Wellington waterfront at Circa Theatre, standing outside Circa Theatre 2. We're inside the recipient of the Harriet Freelander New York Residency, which of course is funded by the Harriet Freelander Scholarship Trust. Uh, the recipient, Arthur Meek, is rehearsing his play on the conditions and possibilities of Hillary Clinton taking me as her young lover. Now Arthur plays uh, Richard Miros in this particular play and we're just getting a little bit worried about Arthur. He seems to be taking on the idea of this character just a bit too much and we're concerned that he might think that Hillary Clinton might actually take him as her young lover. But Arthur's agreed to talk to us today so let's, let's go inside and have a chat to him. So Richard, you'd like me to call you Richard? What else would you call me? Well, we'd call you Arthur Meek. Do you know Arthur Meek? Okay, well, it's Richard. Richard's fine. Richard. So here we are on the on the set of your um, of, of your of your stage show here. Now, are you on a mission for Hillary Clinton to take you as her young mother? Absolutely, two thumbs up. Yes, um, and I do prefer to call it a lecture because that is what it will be. It's an educational mission where people will be astonished by the benefits that will accrue to them if Hillary Clinton takes me as her young lover. So it's not just about you, it's something for the planet. I display myself not on Mrs Clinton per se, but upon what this trans-Pacific partnership could embody, which is of course the baby boomers and millennials coming together to make the world a better place. Sounds, sounds ambitious, it sounds ambitious. So how are you taking this message to um, Mrs Clinton? Uh, it's a multimedia approach. Obviously, we have the lecture, which is always available, um, and you know she knows where I am. We've also experimented through the publication of the Young Lover Activity Guide, which is chock a block full of exhaustive research and lovingly interspersed with fun activities like, for instance, this here word find, very cool, and acrostic DIY poetry. Um, and we have also just completed shooting on the film version so that Hillary will be able to stream it in the comfort of her own pre-presidential palace. And how will you be getting this film to Hillary Clinton? Um, they, I've been telling you this thing, the internet is really good at, at this and I can just put it on here in Wellington and it will arrive in America in no time at all, which is much easier, I found, than me trying to enter the United States, which is not proving to be so easy for some strange reason. Having trouble getting into the United States, Richard? Well, I sent Hillary a letter um, offering my services, and it was a Homeland Security that sent me a letter back saying that she'd received my correspondence, right. and that they'd be keeping a close eye on me and tracking my movements, which I thought was a wonderful burden. Um, but apparently that means that it's harder for me. I'm on some no fly list or something and I don't know quite how else to get to the United States. Mm. So a few challenges for Richard here to actually convince Hillary Clinton to take him as her young lover but obviously um, there's huge benefits for the globe really if this should occur. Absolutely. If you want to find out more about it then um, perhaps you might be able to see this film on, on the internet one day or come down to Circa and see the lecture. Yes. And how much longer have uh, people in Wellington got to, to see that? Well, it's a good question. Technically, it's till the 20th of February, Tuesday to Sunday. But if my statistical analysis proves true, I may be spirited away by the NSA slightly earlier than that. So it's best to book fast. 